got a special guest today. Look who's joined us. Oh man, in the building. Introduce yourself. They already know, bro. Milligram, Chad. Quick hill session. Quickly, man. Aye, new music out soon. Stay locked in. But for now, we're just getting to some work. Let's go. Block number two, you've seen this spot before. This time, the pace is quicker. The hamstring feels well rested. I feel all right, to be honest. I feel like this is a good session to try and test it out. So we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get straight into it, we're not gonna waste any time. so happy to get that done though it's a massive confidence booster to know that I can run pain-free and not cause any problems so it's a really good start to the week the rest of the groups doing five the rest of the groups doing five 50 meter sprints but I'm not gonna push my luck this is the first time I've been able to run at a really solid pace uh, with confidence so I'm just gonna call it there for today do the gym session this afternoon and we'll pick up the running throughout the, the week that's the session complete Ugh. only the real ones know about this the games can't be stopped look at that all the goodness what's that thing? Modern problems for quite a lot. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Wait. <laughs> modern problems require modern solutions. No, that's crazy. It's not about being fancy, it's about getting the job done. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is? It's the fact that you actually have the paper. Nah, as well. yeah, it's just... When you said, does anybody have paper? I was thinking, that's such an empty request, <laughs> like nobody's going to have paper. <laughs> and here we are. <laughs> We're back in the gym. The weights are going up a little bit now, to be honest. We're on 90 kg power cleans. So because it's the start of a new block, we've increased the intensity and dropped the reps a little bit. So instead of doing 10 reps, we're on eight reps and that's allowed me to go a bit heavier. We'll be working on eight reps for the next four weeks or so. So we'll see how far we can take it. Moving on to the bench. Now, if you watch the first couple episodes, you'll see the progress, how crazy it's been. I think on the first episode, I was benching about 75 for 10 reps. Now we're on 95, and this doesn't feel too bad as well, to be honest. So I'd like to push this in the next couple of weeks and see if we can start hitting some 100 kg bench for some reps. Same again with the squats, to be honest. Now we're on 170. Uh, we was on 120 even just last week doing 10 reps. So we've really stacked the weight on for this one. I'm gonna have to be careful not to overdo it, but I'm definitely enjoying seeing the strength gains come back again. Monday, shuttle circuits. We've got 15 reps this time. So we finished the circuits, now we have overhead shot. We're going to be doing a new little series, which is the training group record for, well, how much does it weigh? 7.5? 7.2 kilogram shot put. Gosh. So start from this line and we're throwing outwards. We're gonna all have a quick round today. There's me, Johnny and Chad. Uh, a couple of the other boys might join in as well. Whoever throws the furthest today, we're gonna leave it as a marker, we'll measure it, 
and then we'll come back uh, next week or the week after there'll be a comb there and that's like the the mark to beat so let's see how far we can go Looks can be deceiving. I'm trying to show, man. Um, this is me. Like, no one else is beating that. Bro. All right, we'll see. We'll see. After five throws, we'll see. Where's Chad disappeared to? Oh, he's straight on it. He's not wasting time. Let's go. So we took the win just by the skin of my teeth, but we take those. Silver medalist, what do you have to say about yourself? Oh man, you got to let people win sometimes in life, man. Let people win? <laughs> this is track, there's no letting people win. <laughs> that was good. Bronze medalist, how do you feel? It's calm, I've had a full day at work on site. So I've basically done a gym session before. For, man. <laughs> <laughs> that wraps it up today. Uh, tomorrow, I've got endurance, so I'll see how we go. I might just have to slow it down a little bit, not go too crazy because I've already got a lot of volume in this week. I'm just going to play it smart. It's the start of the next block. Hopefully, Thursday, if everything goes well, I'll put my spikes on. But we'll see. I'm going to be honest. My body is destroyed from the last couple days. Obviously, you've seen in the last video, I've been taking it easy for a couple weeks, kind of just building myself back up. And then on Sunday, which you'll have seen probably earlier in this video, I got back into proper running, did probably the toughest hill session that we've done so far this year. Followed it up with some heavy weights in the gym, like I squatted pretty heavy, and then did circuit training yesterday, and it's just finished my legs off. Both my quads cramped up, my glute cramped up, so I'm feeling it today. I'll see if I'm gonna do the main session or if I'm gonna do an alternate session because I wanna get some volume in this week. Once I get warmed up, I'll get a better idea for what I'm, how I'm feeling. I don't like to judge my body until I'm fully warm, so I'll check back in when I'm warm. <laughs> really happy with that to be honest my rule of thumb is always a one hour warm up and then decide if you're doing the session don't show up to the truck and then say oh, I'm not running I don't feel good warm up fully your body will normally tell you how it's feeling this is a big turning point for the block just got to recover well now this week I need to sleep well recover well probably jump in a couple of cold baths but other than that massive confidence booster what do you reckon to the session no nah, solid man you literally came in and said no nah, i'm definitely not running but just saw how you feel for your warm-up and then bro it's a massive session literally 100 yeah, percent. and you're in flats as well check the flats yeah, yeah in flats man in flats that's not a joke i'm trying to learn from mr world champs here no nah, come on <laughs> back on the track Thursday it's supposed to be speed session so hopefully all going well you might see me running quick for the first time this winter on Thursday no pressure but if I feel good we'll go for it hey, don't get twisted he's saying he's hurt but this guy's in shape <laughs> <laughs> give me six weeks and then we'll be ready so we're back I think I want to do a video that's more like a day in the life of eating but for now i'll just show you what a typical post-training meal looks like so 
generally I probably have something like salmon or tuna and rice and some salad. But today we have, today we've got eggs. I'm not sure how many calories it is. It's probably about 30, 40 calories per egg. In fact, you know what? It's probably more, about 80 calories an egg. But you get about, you get about four grams of protein per egg. So that's it. I'm just gonna eat this now. So four eggs scrambled two slices of toast. Yeah, I always have my eggs well done. If you're not having them well done, then uh, you're doing it wrong because I can't eat them if they're not well done. But yeah, I'm gonna eat these now. It's 10.30 p.m. right now because I train in the evening. So after I've had this, I'm done for the day. I'll check in tomorrow. Power structure. So just like on Sunday, the weights are getting heavier. We've got front squat today, 90 kg on the bar, and this is probably the heaviest I've done all winter once again. I think we started on 80, uh, we've worked our way up to 85 and now 90, so it's looking good. My main focus here, especially with the front squats, is to not sacrifice my form whilst I'm getting heavier, so I'll keep an eye on that. So moving on to jump squat, again we keep this at about 60kg, there's not really much need to go much heavier than about 60 on jump squats. The main focus is just to move the bar quickly, if I put too much weight on then I'll not be able to do that, so we keep it light. And we're doing a little bit of paused bench press just to wrap up the session nicely. What I can say is generally my strength is coming back massively in all of my lifts, so I'm excited to see how we're going to progress in the next few weeks, but for now I'm really happy with the gains being made in the gym. All right, Thursday session. We're back at the indoor track. Today's the first day uh, of winter where I'll be moving pretty fast. Uh, the rest of the group, they do have flat out runs. So it's uh, nine 80 meters. Uh, the aim of the session is to go quick. But for me, I'm gonna run about 90%. I'm gonna spike up, run them at 90%, nice and smooth. I'm gonna put some more force down into the track, cut some shapes, but I'm not gonna really force it. That's some, uh, that's some 60, not 60s, 80s, 680 meters. That feels pretty good, you know. Again, they were about 90% pace. We got six of them done. Uh, we opted to end, end the session at six, uh, just for safety reasons, because it's the quickest I've moved for quite a while. And the main priority now is just making sure I recover from session to session and show up each day, like ready to roll and I can get the volume in. So I'm happy with that, definitely. Uh, again, I've been saying this all week, like the confidence is just getting there, just growing each session. Really happy with this. So now we've got three standing long jumps. What's happening today? I think um, everyone's a bit under par. They're feeling pressure, I think. They're feeling the pressure because a big man up and that. Meow. I tried John Farr. Oh, 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 Tyler Jones, is that you? Two ninety. Oh, no. it looked for. It no. looked for, but wasn't. No. <laughs> Back in 
325. The full Greg Rutherford landing as well. <laughs> 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 Robots are away! 320. Ah. <laughs> it's 1 1 now. 1 1. 1 1. Overhead short, minute. standing long jump. That was a good effort. I was happy with the last jump though. Nah, no, it was good still. We gotta let them win something, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>